All right, so now we've got our somewhat ugly page and we're going to add some nav bars. Uh, let me show you here. Uh, hold on, just sorry, putting a password in here. And then we're logging in. We have our our page here, which is the first page once we log in, but you can see that this nav bar here, it's not like in anything. So I asked Chad GPT, I said, how can I add a, a nav bar? It says create a nav bar dot handlebars in your views slash partials folder. So now we have to add a new folder inside views called partials. And then once we go inside partial, we add a new folder called navbar.handlebars. In this new file, create your navbar HTML code. For example, you might use the nav element with under with an unordered list of links. In each of your main handlebar files. Okay, 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 okay. So what's uh so I can say give me a file to use. All right, easy. All right, so there's our new nav bar handlebars. Let me go back through here. In each of the pages where you want it to appear, uh, yeah, see right there, blah, 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 nav bar. So we have to put this basically in each of our pages. And since we're right here, probably test that out, but I also have to add the app.js. I think that's already set. I just have to create this. Oh, you know what? I have to update this X E X P H B S constant in app.js. Uh What's the constant called? It's this one. Is that right? Is that right? It looks right. Um, and then we're gonna go back to sign in dot handlebars. Or is it dashboard dot handlebars? Well, we'll just add it to all of them. Uh, nav bar, right at the top of body, right? right at the top of body. So there's dashboard. There is sign in. Perhaps there as well, I'm not sure. Wait, wait, wait. In each of your handlebars files, right? Look, I'm kind of maybe I don't know. We'll see. Uh, let's reload it and see how this works. That looks okay to me. Realistically, I should have just tested it with one first, but. Hmm. I don't think it understood. Okay, okay. So. Yeah, you see that right there? Styles.css. That's not right. Right, so I have to go back into navbar, right? The handlebars. Oh wait, hold on a second. Uh, 
Ah, okay. I don't think I had to add any. It just included in the main layout file, so I didn't have to add any of those. Okay. <laughs> I just had to put it here only. That's beautiful. Even in dashboard, why are you even in there? You don't need to be in there. Okay, sign in. You don't really need to be in. And that's probably why it's doubled up too. Right. Go back to main body. That ain't it. I wonder if it's got to reload it. Like, I have to reset this guy. That didn't work. All right, so hold on a second. Okay, that's better. Right, so I'm not really sure what's going on here. How you can include it in the nav bar in your main layout file. Okay, that makes sense.
So I'll need to put it in there. You'll need to put the navbar partial in main. Okay. Here's an updated version of main dot handlebars. So I said, so I guess I'm supposed to use. 